Hey everybody, it's Gary the Google Guy here with a brand new update for Google Sheets, and that is now the ability to add drop-down chips that are customized to what you want. So recently Google has added people, maps, and events for chips that you can add in your sheets. Well, now you can customize these. So if we go to the top left of our screen and go to the insert menu, you will now see the option for drop-down. We click on that and you'll see it immediately gives me my drop down arrow in the middle of my screen. And to the far right side of the screen, a data validation rules box has popped out. So let's show you both. To the left, middle of our screen, click the drop down. You'll see that I can modify my option one and two from here. Click on the pencil and I can modify or in my data validation window to the right, underneath the criteria where it says drop down, this is where I can customize it, but I can also select my other data validation pieces if I want. But today what we are gonna do is we are gonna make option number one. How about we do the almighty project management piece complete. Option two, in progress. To the left of that, I can click and I can color code to whatever I want. So we'll say green is complete. Red is going to be in progress, but we're gonna click on that one first. And it actually looks like my in progress piece did not take very well, so let's just clean that up. I can add additional items if I want, some advanced options. Click on done. And now I'll have that rule set up for that particular dropdown. So now whenever I wanna use those, I've got complete or in progress. And as a side trick, if you click that little box to the right side of it, you can drag this down and have those arrows appear in your entire column that way. So that's how you're gonna use your new drop down chips in Google Sheets. And until we meet again, another day, another time, another update, this is Gary the Google Guy, signing off.